Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm wanting to do a little bit of a comparison video for you guys. This is comparing the Apray Gel X. They'll have listed down, um, all the boxes pretty much look like this. They do have some colored ones and some white ones that come in it, uh, either a colored box or white box, but they'll say Apray Gel X Nail Extensions soft gel 500 pieces 10 sizes and then you'll have either natural or sculpted right here i always buy the natural because i have a flat nail bed and most people do but this uh sculpted is for people that have more of a curved nail bed and um people with a flat nail bed can wear natural or sculpted but people with more of the rounded nail bed can only wear the sculpted they cannot wear the natural and then they'll have next to it whether they are round stiletto coffin whatever and then that will be either short medium long extra long extra extra i think it goes up to like 5x or something like that crazy long nails but I will say, not your average clientele is not asking for those crazy long nails. About the only people you see that wear some crazy long nails like that are nail techs, models, people like that. Your average clientele is usually asking for what they call sport length, which is more on the shorter side. Maybe it's in between a short and a medium. But that's what most, most clientele ask for is a, either a short or a sport length. So I have here, just for some comparisons, these these are the six that I offer to my clientele. We have short, we have medium, and we have long. I've never had anyone ask for anything outside of short, medium, or long. And some people even say the short is too long. They want the short one cut down just a little bit. So I have, for the short, I have a uh, round, which is this one, and a stiletto, which is this one. So I'll kind of line those up. You can see the difference. That is uh, stiletto and round in the short. And you can take these. Let's say you had this stiletto on your client and they actually wanted it. Uh, you know square you can just kind of file that down get a square but i am going to go ahead and buy the other um size uh shapes in the shorts um and then here we have medium square on this side and medium coffin on this side and these are the mediums square and coffin but usually what i do if someone is wanting a short coffin or a short square i'll just go ahead and put the medium on them and cut it down a little bit and then for the long i have a long coffin and a long stiletto i'll go ahead and i'll take and I'll show you guys what they kind of working with here. That is what you're working with for the short stiletto. So as you can see with the short stiletto, that's, even, that's got a little bit of length to it. And honestly, that's usually enough for most people. Most clientele, that is enough length for them. So that's the stiletto. Oh, that stuff wants to stick so well. And this is the short round. got a decent little bit of length with it as you can see short round these are usually the ones i wear personally is the short round they are my favorite 
so far. I like them a lot. So this is the short round. And as you guys can see, I have just normal size nails. I don't have particularly big or small nails. They're pretty normal sized nail beds. Oh, mercy. This is going to be the medium stiletto. It's not one to stick all that well. This is the medium stiletto. It's got a pretty good amount of length. And I put down this white paper and painted them black just for you guys to be easier easier for you to see and compare with. Just easier for you guys to see. So this is the medium coffin. I'm sorry, I think I called it a stiletto. This is the medium coffin. I really like that one actually I might go with this one the next time I do my nails I kind of like that I do I kind of like that one a lot they have a very nice if you can see the apex and everything on these is is uh, it's very very nice these are very nice nails and I know they are more on the expensive side but I do believe in offering the best for my clientele they last a good long time I don't have many people complain about lifting or anything like that this is the medium square I'm kind of feeling that medium coffin. That might be the next one I do, you guys. I was really feeling it when I had it on. This is the long coffin. long long coffin as you can see that's really long I don't have very many people ask oh I had a little bit of paint still wet on it I don't have many people ask for nails this long but some people do some people really like them I am not a nails this long kind of girl no way Jose I'm definitely a shorter nails type girl. Those those do look nice though. They really do. And they look good on the people that like them. I've always just thought, oh, I wouldn't be able to do anything with them on. But I've come to find out that's not really accurate. You can usually do just about anything you'd normally do. You get used to them. That's what people tell me. You get used to them. Okay. And this is the long stiletto. And it's not laying flush on my finger. Let me, let me fix it. There we go. So this one is the long stiletto. It's pretty long. So that's my little comparison for the six different lengths and styles that I have to offer for the appray 
And I think I am going to order just one pack of the extra long. And put it in a back drawer somewhere in case someone ever comes in and wants it. I think I will do that. Alright guys, hit that like and subscribe button. Leave me a comment down below. I love to hear from you. Let me know what your favorite size is. If you like to wear those long claws or if you're more of a shorty girl like me. Let me know what your favorite style is. If it's coffin, almond, round, square. I love to hear from you guys and find out what you like. I'll see you in the next one.